If you feel like you're not sleeping enough at night, you are not alone. The CDC says more than one third of American adults do not sleep enough on a regular basis. And this really affects people who are shift workers. So if you're work, uh, watching us right now, you're probably one of us. But mm -hmm. now a new study says the lack of sleep could be even more detrimental to your health than uh, researchers thought before. 24 Hour News 8's Emily Kinzer is live at Community Hospital North with more on the new study. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. This new study was done by researchers at Wheaton College in Illinois and presented at the Alzheimer's Association International Conference in London. That study suggests that pos there's a possible link that poor sleep in middle age may lead to Alzheimer's. In sleep fragmentation, or better known as lack of sleep, we generate protein, and that protein leads to plaques in the brain, which is also seen in Alzheimer's. This is something that people with a family history of Alzheimer's really need to be aware about. I talked to a local doctor about the issue, and he says sleep is important and should be addressed early in life before any symptoms of dementia or Alzheimer's. We know for many years that people with sleep disorder like sleep apnea and sleep fragmentation, they notice short-term memory changes, like where did I put my key? Where, is my, where did I park my car? Dr. Haddad also said about 50% of people with Alzheimer's will have some degree of sleep apnea after the diagnosis. Now, if you're feeling tired during the day on a normal basis, that's not normal. Of course, we all have days where we're feeling more tired than normal, but if that's a regular basis, you may should get checked out. And the best way to do that is either go through a sleep study, like uh, this office building here behind me, or do some type of home test at home. You guys. Mm. Okay. Harsh reality, right? Yes, it is. Because we don't ever get enough sleep. <laughs> no, and sometimes.